Hello guys, Janus here and welcome to Linus W. How to farm Diamonds Guide. Especially if you are a free to play player. That's it, let's get this started. The best way to earn a lot of diamonds in this game is gonna be by clearing out the missions from the mission board. You will be able to find the mission board in almost every village out there in the map. Just enter any village out there and then click on the navigation menu, then click on the board and click on the movement and you will be able to automatically access the mission board, all right? And click on the mission tab here you will be able to see a lot of emblem quest that is being posted by the other players out there as the mission okay in case a player cannot complete their own uh, emblem quest then they can post out their emblem quest as a mission in the mission board so that the other players can complete it for them and in return for clearing out their emblem quest you will be able to receive a lot of diamonds in return usually 10 diamonds okay so there we go guys anyways so here we go we have some emblem quest that we can accept at this time all right so look at this click on accept and for this you have to deposit two diamonds all right and uh, that is actually a very big problem for the free to play player because free to play players usually do not start with any diamonds at all zero diamonds right so how you can get the two diamonds that you require in order to accept the emblem quest in the first place well you can actually go to the trade market and you can start selling your items which i will be discussing a little bit in a while okay so there we go guys anyways uh, uh pay the two diamonds and you will be able to accept that particular quest and look at that guys so what's gonna happen is that like if you are actually going to forfeit that particular emblem quest in case if you were not able to clear it then well guess what guys you will be losing your two diamonds in the first place and your reputation will also decrease so it is actually not recommended at all to decline or forfeit the already accepted mission okay so be careful about that one and as your quest rank keeps on improving you will be able to uh, accept a lot of uh, missions at a single time so try to keep on doing a lot of them and try to keep on uh, getting higher quest ranks so that you can actually accept a lot of mission at the same time so that the other players will not snatch it away from you all right so there we go guys and for now my quest rank is just only uh, level 2 so that means like I can only um, uh, accept a total of two quest rank okay so if I try to accept this one right over here it says can't accept any more mission all right now there will be a lot of problems like this exclamation mark right over here if there's no exclamation mark then that means like you can pretty much accept that particular uh, emblem quest so if there's an exclamation mark so what does it mean well let's check it out it says right over here you cannot carry out silver Knights village mission meaning like you have not actually completed this quest even for the first time okay and possibly you have not even unlocked that content in the first place okay <laughs> so that is the reason why uh, so all you need to do is try to keep on progressing through your main story content and eventually you will be able to unlock this particular content and uh, there are like other type of uh, errors which says no emblem quest has been completed today today if that is the error that is being shown then that means that you have not cleared this particular mission today you have to clear the particular mission that is being uh, posted right over here so that you can clear that again for the another player if you have not completed for yourself in the first place then how come you can actually cre clear it for the other players right so actually makes some sense so these are the uh, emblem quests that I have not actually uh, completed or cleared out for today so that means like if there is another player out there who is actually going to post out the mission uh, related to this particular emblem quest right over here then I will not be able to do it for today but to those uh, emblem quests that I've actually cleared out already then well for that uh, emblem quest mission I will be able to accept them and even clear them and later on I will be able to receive those handsome diamond rewards okay so yeah there we go guys so that's how it works right over here so anyways now for me guys it's time for me to clear out this mission right over here so in that case guys I can actually teleport to that particular location uh, and start clearing them now that said for the free to play players it's actually a very big problem how to gain the initial two 
diamonds for deposit, right? So that you can actually start earning a lot more diamonds in return. So for that, you have to click on the top right corner, go to the trade market. Uh, in order to access the trade market, you have to register your device with your mobile number, okay? So please do that and you will be able to access, uh, access it right away. And then what you can do is you can actually sell the items that you have in access, okay? So that you can actually get some diamonds in return. All right, so uh, let's say if I want to uh, sell this particular item like leather, okay, so right over here, uh, I can actually sell one quantity for like 10 diamonds or I can actually increase the quantity so that um, it will be a little bit more, uh, you know, like uh, uh, good for the other players out there or uh, it can be a very attractive deal for them to actually say um, yes to this deal right away so that they cannot say no to it so yeah that is the thing right over here if you keep on Im increasing the charge of that particular product definitely there will be a high chance that the particular other players will not be purchasing your product okay so yeah that is it anyways do your uh, marketing stuff right over here and these are the items that I've already listed out there for selling okay so here we go guys um, you know, like, don't underestimate your products. Even if they are common items, there are certain players out there in the market who are actually going to buy your product, okay? So be optimistic and just list it right away, whatever you have earned as droppings, all right? So yeah, there we go, guys. And in case if you are very desperate to get uh, diamonds right away, then guess what, guys? You can actually start selling your uh, weapon scroll or let's say your armor scroll, you know, the, those scrolls that will allow you to upgrade the level of your uh, weapon or your armor or even your accessory right so if you can actually sell them well there are so many players out there who would actually be quite happy to purchase them right away provided that you are actually selling them in a very competitive or a cheaper price okay as you can see right over here in the sets uh, if I actually go to the uh, Come on right over here and then well if you are to check it out look at this the armor scroll right over here all right uh, especially the weapon scroll sorry about that <laughs> it's a little bit messed up anyways the weapon magic scroll right over here it's being um, you know like sold out in like 19 diamonds at the cheapest price okay so if you can actually sell your weapon magic scroll in like 17 uh, diamonds or like let's say 18 diamonds then well there's a very high chance that someone is gonna purchase it right away and there you go you will have your diamonds right away and this is how I actually managed to get my first diamonds so that I can start doing those emblem quest or those missions from the mission board all right so there we go guys and I myself am pretty much uh, you know like uh, really excited to get this kind of deal right over here it's pretty cheap okay so there boom there we go and that's it all right somebody actually out there in the market action managed to get my 19 diamonds all right so yeah there we go uh, just do it and uh, wish you best of luck try to sell out you know like the best possible items that you have got in your inventory so that you can get your first initial diamonds now that said let's get back to our main topic once again and that's gonna be the missions okay so right now I've got like these two missions right over here one seems to revenge a uh, defeat wild dog and next one is gonna be a defeat zombies and stuff like that right so I'm actually gonna go to the wild dog and the best feature in the lineage W is that we have got this teleport function all right so just uh, you know, like pays the amount of Adina that it is actually requiring us and then we will be able to teleport to that location right away and boom we can uh, already start to kill the enemy uh, if you want you can actually even you know like uh, move to that particular location where you want to just click on the any part of the map where you want to go and then click on auto move and your character will auto move to that particular location right away that's how easy it is all right but if you are in different island you will not be able to walk to that particular location you really do have to teleport Port. Okay, so there we go guys and well, uh, I will be defeating the wild dogs and now it says I have to defeat like 100 wild dog in order to complete this emblem quest, right? And as I told you, in order to accept any particular mission, I must have already uh, clear that emblem quest right away in the first place my very own okay and then only i will be able to accept that emblem quest later on from the other player so that i can clear them and then later on get rewarded by the diamonds as being posted out by the other players out there so yeah that said let's skip to the part where i'm gonna be getting my diamonds 
All right, now we are done. 100 over 100 dogs defeated. And now it's time to go back to the village. Let's click on the go back home teleport scroll. And then we can actually go and access the mission board once again. All right, so our character is going to go there right away. Let's wait for her for, for to reach there. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so there we go, mission board. And now, after completing a particular mission that you have already accepted, click on the payout right over here, and boom, there we go, guys. Not only that, your deposit will be safely returned to you, you will also be receiving the payout. That's gonna be 10 diamonds extra. So that is great, isn't it? Right, there we go, you have earned 12 diamonds and with that definitely it's gonna provide a little bit of experience points right away in your quest rank higher the quest rank more the uh, missions that you will be able to accept in a single time so there we go guys that's how it is uh, all right so next right over here there we go let's accept it right away to deposit okay boom there we go that's it and uh, I am having like two uh, missions that I gotta complete in order to receive like 20 diamonds in total 20 diamonds and this is how I have actually managed to get a lot of diamonds thus far and definitely this is a really great help even to the free to play players out there why because thanks to diamonds you can actually purchase a lot of amazing amazing equipments for your um, uh, hero or for your character from the trade market all right and this is the reason how I actually managed to get a lot of amazing amazing materials all of these items so thus far I've actually uh, purchased it from the market except for this cloak right over here uh, rest of the others totally from the market guys and I'm pretty happy with this a lot of really good stuff because Linus W uh, more than the level up boost it is really focusing more on the equipment stats okay if your equipment stats are really good your character is definitely going to perform a lot more better in the battlefield out there so be careful about that one all right so let's go to the trade market it actually takes some time to load up all right so just wait for it and boom there we go we have got a lot of amazing amazing stuff right over here like right over here the corner robe only for 10 diamonds we have got this helm of uh, magic defense that is 10 diamonds we have got the shirt and stuff like that so many other stuff you can even actually purchase equipments or like let's say you know those uh weapons that you need to equip to your favorite character like magic staff stuff of mana we have got uh, uh, stuff of strength well this is actually not a really good deal right out here i mean like you are not supposed to purchase a staff of strength for 450 diamonds you can pretty much craft it which i'm actually going to be talking out in the different guide video all right how to actually take advantage of the uh trade market and how not to fall for the trap in the trade market and how to do it right how to be really uh clever when it comes to trade market i'll try to come up with a really good guide for this later on in the uh you know, like upcoming days but till then this is it for today i hope you enjoyed this video please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and if you have got any other extra questions please do let me know in the comment section below i will try my best to uh, clear out your questions uh, your confusions and whatever that you have to ask to me all right so anyways that's it this is it for today see you guys in the next video have fun with linus w and once again happy new year 2022